<laughs> Hello, y'all. Yeah, I think I introduced the date is Friday, September 3rd, 2021 at 11.28 a.m. So I guess this is the dress y'all gonna see me wearing every day for an indefinite amount of time. I don't know how long y'all be wearing this dress. I guess till the weather gets colder. But it's kind of comfortable but uncomfortable. It's too long and I need I need some scissors to um get to trim it or I don't know how to hem. But sorry for the conversation. But I'm still having problems with um I'm sorry for their background noise. I'm still uploading. I mean, I'm having trouble with um, trying to charge my phone. So maybe tomorrow I can get another charger. I've gotten either ignored or quite a few job rejections on Indeed from Indeed, the applications that I put in. He didn't wait till I start to do a video to freaking over talk talk all night. They know I'm, they probably know I'm doing a video, but um, I got this from my my storage unit to help motivate me. You know, um, the the Holy Bible, the one that's um placed by the Gideons. You can't find a King James Version no more, and this is like one of my favorite Bibles. And you know, I like it when they tell you, you know, I like this. And I like, um, you know, stuff like this. And then I think they have a few of the languages, like John 3 and 16, I think, in different languages. Mm. Yeah, so the fake IDMR cult does not tell us that we must be born again. And they don't quote the, for God to love the world, that he gave his only begotten son, that whoever so, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish. I mean, should not perish, but have everlasting life. You know, they don't, and, and they, yeah, I said they don't tell us about how we must be born again. So this video won't be much longer because they're making too much damn noise. Look at me, I shouldn't have cursed. But um, they're making too much noise. <clears throat> there wasn't all that commotion. That's the devil. But this, I got this Bible from that hospitality in hotel where they changed towards me. Shut up. They changed towards me and started perping me. You know, and y'all supposed to be a Christian hotel, a Christian based hotel. And y'all gang participate in gang stalking. I'm sorry for my language, but it's gang stalking fuck out of me. Like gang stalking me super heavy and really bad, and then lied on me and banned me, and, and you know, and having hypocritical rule and stuff. So since they're making so much noise, I'm gonna have to go. They're doing this on purpose. I know it's the public, but they're perps and they're waiting till I don't have trying to do a video to um, be disruptive. We in a library. Back in the 90s, when you were in the library back in the 90s, everybody was like, shh. But nowadays, people can be as loud as they want in the library.